What up, Heart Squad? Today we're opening up the golden Elite Trainer Boxes, the Zashian and Zamazenta Golden Elite Trainer Boxes will be opened up in today's video. Collector's Cash sent me these to open up, so thank you so much, Collector's Cash. But in the meantime, this is a product that I have not opened yet, even though they were released a few months ago. But on the inside lies potential salvation. Salvation meaning... I believe there are some vivid voltage packs on the inside of these things. And I still haven't even pulled that chunk of chew. Still haven't even pulled the Leon full art card. And I will, if you saw some videos from last week, be officially continuing my opening Pokemon cards in the library series, potentially this week. So if you're excited and ready for those, please consider subscribing to the channel and, and, and as always, leave a like, especially for proper grammar. So if you don't know what these things are, they're basically like a hundred-ish dollars or at least they used to be a hundred dollars. I'm pretty sure they're still actually right around that. And there's two of them, the Zamazenta one, Zashian one. I'm gonna start with the Zashian one because that's my favorite. And you're asking me, the, they're not gold. What are you talking about? Just wait until you see the inside. Now, I, like I said, not opened these before, but I've seen pictures. Oh, that's beautiful. But that's still not what I'm talking about as we will turn around so you can see both sides. That really is sleek looking, I gotta say. And especially this, look at that. Wait, hold on. Oh, that does smell beautiful. Sword and Shield Player's Guide. It's a player's guide. Um, I guess this is just going over types of cards that were released. Top combos. So just some advice. Nothing. Just credits. Yeah, credits. There's uh, some Vivid Voltage and top trainer cards of the Sword and Shield era. And then, oh, there's the card list. So I believe there are gold cards that do come in this. So pretty cool. You know, that's kind of a cool little thing to hold on to. But wait, where is it? Where is it? That's pretty much it. No, I'm kidding. So, if you go like this, and this is the big cardboard on the inside. Let's take a look, see. So this is nothing new. What else do we have? There we go. All right. So a beautiful Zashian V Gold has been just pulled out of the box. It's not official or anything, but it does count. And I will be leaving this sealed for now. So centering wise, it's not bad. It's not perfect, but I'll take it. What else do we got in these things? What are these? Oh, whoa, now that's sleek. These are the card dividers, thicker, longer. Just gonna run out of adjectives there, but they are uh, pokeballs on the top. <laughs> Leaving little to the imagination today. If you've seen this, you now have. There's the code card for that. Good luck to everybody. We'll take a look at all the packs. Ooh, look at these. Golden sleeves. Hopefully we'll need those for today. And then there's just a bunch of golden, look at this. Like golden coins for the damage counter and poison counter. A fairly heavy Zashian golden. Yeah, you can hear that, right? That works, that works. Golden coin. And then, wow! The dice! Those are like pretty heavy golden dice. Look at that. I mean, they could have been a little bit more beautiful with the dice. There's just like little numbers on it, but you know, I like that they're heavy. That's a plus. And so, there we go with the actual Elite Trainer Box box itself. Let's go like that so you can see it closed. Whoa, that's really cool. So, all right, what do we got packs wise? Very nice, so we have three Vivid Voltage packs. We have, wow, five Darkness Ablaze, some Rebel Clash, and then one Sword and Shield base set. So I'll just randomly open those. And don't forget, we will get to the Zama Zenta one soon enough. I wanna get into this first Vivid Voltage. Oh, it's crammed in there, but we you know, what can you do? So this is the first Golden Elite Trainer Box, Zashian and Zamazenta. 
Let's see what we can do. It's time for a little, you may have heard of it, the Leonard trademark pad in it. Guess the energy psychic and away we go. Memory Capsule, Toys R Us Giraffe, Weedle, Drillber, Clefairy, Whelmer, Tynamo, Waylord, and a Galarian Darmanitan V. So I'll take it. I mean, it's a very, very common one. So now let's go Darkness to Blaze. Basically the main card you wanna get, of course, is a fiery breathing dragon thing called Charizard VMAX. Leaf Energy. So let's see what we can do in these specific packs. Now I will be continuing more Vivid Voltage openings at the library, like I said. So I'm excited about that. And I'm, rep I'm obviously recording this in advance. Um, so potentially this week, as we get into some Rebel Clash, you'll have the first library opening, Fighting Energy. First one in over a year because of everything that has been going on. So I'm excited about that. Bunnelby, Dragapult, in a Garvador non-holographic. Uh, let's go with the original. Sword and Shield, and let's see if we can get a Zacian Gold card out of a Zacian Golden Elite Trainer Box. So there is the code. Four cards, Fire Energy, Citrus Berry, Quillfish, Energy Switch, Blitbug, Rhyhorn, Min, Chin, Krogunk, Kingler, and a Claydol non-holographic. So, so far, just that one Galarian Darmanitan V. Uh, let's get into another Darkness Ablaze pack. If you missed the videos from this past weekend, they were absolutely phenomenal and exciting videos. Leaf Energy, I'm not biased, you're biased. Uh, well, it was a guess that great on Sunday. And the video before that was a massive mystery box filled with packs, older packs, not like Wizards of the Coast. I'm talking about like platinum, diamond and pearl, black and white, sets that you just don't see open too often. And cause y'all requested that. And so if you missed that video, please go check out that. Uh, Metal Energy, as soon as you're done watching this one. So. For Vivid Voltage, it's not just the Leon and the Pikachus that I would like to pull. There's also a Nessa Full Art and Secret Rare, as I'm going to sneeze, and I don't want to. So nothing in that pack. Don't sneeze. Rebel Clash. So I like how you can like go back in several videos that I've done and always just see like, oh, Lee, Lee, he's going like this. That means he's about to sneeze. There's just like dust in my dust in my studio. I don't think that, that's fine. Uh, psychic energy, dust in my studio, and it just gets everywhere. Okay, I love a more peco that's upside down. Far fetched, hone edge, nine tails, reverse rare, and a pinkerchin V. Okay, well it's the ultra rare V parade today. Let's get into a, another darkness ablaze pack and see what we can do in this one. Four cards, lightning energy. Cape of Toughness, Carnivine, Falafi, Skid, Galette, Hippopotas, Larvesta, Vanillish, Muck. Don't let go, Muck. All right. So we are fast approaching the end of the Zacian box, but we will get into the Golden Zamazenta box as soon as this one is done. Fighting energy. There we go. Pats on back, everybody. Old PC, Solrock, Electric. Mr. Mime, Rookity, Tauros, Sinistee, Flygon. All right, and now we're down with the final three packs. Vivid Voltage, please, please, please give us something good. And this is the final Vivid Voltage of this box. Psychic Energy, yes, it's a premonition. Hats on back. There was a fortune cookie that somebody had tweeted me. And it said, Pat's on back, or, or when you guess right, it was like they, they watched my videos, the fortune cookie makers. Voltorb, Excadrill, and a Colossal V. Well, we got a hit again. Like I said, it's the V Ultra Rare Parade today. Rebel Clash, now I know a lot of people aren't the most fondest of Rebel Clash. There's Boss's Orders in this set. I didn't even think I've pulled the Hyper Rare yet, Lightning Energy of Boss's Orders. So, DeBlade, Clefairy, Super Mario, Wingle, Phantom of the Opera, and a Seismitoad non-holographic. All right, final pack of the first box, final Darkness Ablaze pack, and 
Psychic Energy. All right, Dartrix, Clang, Struggle Gloves, Mareep, Ducklet, Don't Let Go Grimer, Clink, Wimpod, Morlul, and a Suicune Holographic. All right, well, I'll show you the pulls. First off, just the one that comes with the box, a beautiful golden Zacian. Then it's just been three regular ultra rare cards, nothing too crazy, but, Let's get into Zama Zenta. Pretty excited about just more chances at opening Vivid Voltage. The other sets um, are nice, but honestly, it's all about that Vivid Voltage. Wow, look at that. So I'm gonna guess this, this booklet is, yeah, it's probably the exact same, so nothing crazy there. And away we go opening up this golden box with the divider out of the way. Packs are probably gonna be the same, just like this thing. And where's the golden card? Here it is. So there we go. Golden Zamazenta V. This one is pretty much the same as far as centering goes. A little top heavy, but that's beautiful combo. Look at that. They do. They definitely sparkle in the light, so I'll take it. Some more of these dividers, which I, I'm, I'm guessing it's just perfectly for, you know, for this elite trainer box. I don't know if they'll fit in other ones. And then here are, ooh, whoa, wait, are these? These are darker dice. Yeah, look at that. It's like a grayish dice and these are goldish ones. Interesting. And then the coins are, oh, they're also different coins. I like these better. Oh wait, no, they're the same. Never mind. But what about this coin? It's gonna be a Zamazenta. So there's the coin. Zamazenta coin, and there's the sleeves, golden goodiness with those, and finally, the code. Good luck to whoever gets that. So I'm gonna put this yonder, and they are all in their orders of what they come in. And, whoa, never mind. okay, uh, three, excuse me, three sword and shield packs, three rebel clash packs, Three Darkness Ablaze in three. Interesting. So they went with more Sword and Shield packs in that one. I'm just glad they didn't take away any Vivid Voltage packs. So let's get into the first Vivid Voltage pack. Uh, I'll go with Rest in Peace Fairy Energy, Leaf Energy. Very nice. Pants on back. Uh, very nice with the Guessy Energy today. Zeb Striker, Klaba, Electrike, Execute, Eevee, Aracuda, and a Grapple. All right, nothing there. Uh, I'll go with a base set, Sword and Shield. It's a nice set. Let's see if we can get that Golden Zamazenta, but here is the code for that. Four cards, and I'll say oh, Leaf Energy. <laughs> All right, Team Yelgrunt, Drizzle, Yamper, Klava, Gotney, Great Value Squirtle, Rhyhorn, Ferrothorn, and a Corviknight. Non-holographic. Rebel class time. Okay, if we can get the boss's orders, that will be a big, big win, whether it's in full art or hyper rare form. Metal energy, Metacham, Beware, Speed Energy, Stuffle, Lotad, Growlithe, Roly Coley, Metatite, Yamask, and a evil Disney Queen, Malamar V. That's beautiful. Well, the background's beautiful of that card, so. I'll take it, I'll take it. It's like the biggest pull of the day, basically. Now, Darkness Blaze. Let's see, basically, just want that Charizard from this set, so let's see what we can do. Um, I'm gonna say Metal Energy for this one. Yellhorn, Falafi, Carnivine, Jiggly, Duglet, Carablast, Darumaka, Rose Tower, and a Mimikyu. Nothing from that. Let's go with another Vivid Voltage. Gotta hit something from one of these with the amount of pulls that I still need to make from this set. Lightning Energy. That was supposed to be in honor of Pikachu. Drone Rotom, Drillbur, Wilmer, Cottony, Alistair, and an Executor non holographic. All right, back to a base set sword and shield pack. Chilling Rain is the upcoming Pokemon T. I know they're like printing stuff left and right. Lightning Energy when it comes to new sets. Um, however, as I've mentioned before, Chilling Rain will be the upcoming set based around Galarian Birds and potentially Sazbuck, 
the legendary form and stuff and lots of incredible alternate arts for that set and i think it's going to be a very very exciting set to open it up so i am excited about that fire energy all right zoelius familiar bell marini torchic starly skarmory gatheta and still no like crazy pull yet but with another rebel clash as we have several packs to go in this opening i think just from this one box other than the golden card we've just pulled the uh, malamar v lightning energy so let's see if we can try to amp those up a little bit voltorb sandy volpix coffee shanks zamazenta there we go taking all i can get at this point folks and now we have one of each pack remaining so oh, let's see let's go with vivid voltage come on daddy needs a new pikachu the full art there's the code for that i will say fighting energy that's a sign lighting energy swoop there it is whoop there it is Talo. charmander whoop there it is pooch and explode well the search continues for anything from dude voltage basically anything have not even pulled my own card the leon card all right so this is the final rebel clash pack let's see what have i not set water energy halosan training court lamp scove caterpie barb Aracuda, Caterpie, Seismitoad once again. All right, just so you can see it, the lone pull from this box so far is a very nice watercolory background of Malamar V. Final sword and shield pack. Gotta get me something good. Watch it be like a Lapras V or something. Psychic energy, all right. Dubwool, Quillfish, Pokey Kid, Goldeen, Roselia, Ghastly, Pawn, Sizzle, and Galarian Perserker, and the crowd goes wild with the creepy creep Pokemon. Well, we're here. That is it, my friends. One more pack. Darkness Ablaze pack. Let's see if we can get some last pack magic with this one. Four cards, uh, let's see, Psychic Energy. It has to be Psychic Energy for the final guess, the energy. Birdkeeper, Toby, Steeny, Ferret, Shelmet, Panpour, Teddy Ursa, Rookity, Torchic, Poltegeist is a uncommon, and Tyranitar, Holographic. Well, that is it, my friends. If you enjoyed today's opening, leave a like, and if you want more, click on those videos right now. My name is Lean Art Sass, and stay positive, and as always, I will see y'all in the next video.